All right, guys, so my number two favorite feature in Lightroom is a quick one, but I absolutely love it. It is under the crop tool. Now, the crop tool, my favorite shortcut to get there is a letter R, so when I click the letter R, it's gonna take me right to the crop tool. Now, once in the crop tool, there's a new little feature over here, a new little button that says auto. When you click it, what it's gonna do is it's gonna basically do essentially what the lens correction tool was doing before. It's gonna actually help you crop your image by straightening it according to what it feels like is the straight line on the image. Now, in this photo, it's a little bit complicated. We got, we got these guys uh, head button out, you know, right after the game, or excuse me, it was after, actually after a touchdown. So we got Larry Fitzgerald, the head button, his teammate. Um, we do got these guys, you can see I shot it kind of at an angle. And so using the crop tool, if I hit auto here, it's gonna go and it's gonna actually fix that for me. So it's basically looking at the image and it's trying to find how can I straighten this image a little bit more uh, to help uh, to help it out. So again, before you could come down in the lens correction tool and hit auto down here and it would do that for you as well, right? Um, and they did a decent job. I mean, did a great job actually. Um, but I do find that when I'm in a hurry and I'm just kind of going through and, and you know, need to fix a horizon, for example, hit the letter R, hit the little auto button, and I'm, I'm moving on in a hurry. Now, uh, let's just see if we can find one more image that, uh, you know, we can just kind of, oh, here we go. It's kind of a whimsical little image when I was, is actually when I was walking in Italy in Venice and I looked up and I saw this cat peeking out the window. And so, for example, here we go. We got this line going down. I hit the letter R, hit auto. And you can see Lightroom just goes there and fixes it right up. So if you haven't checked that out, definitely go do it. Crop tool, auto, button. It's my number two favorite little thing that I'm using in Lightroom CC. I'm gonna come right up here where it says photo, go down to photo merge, photo merge, or you can call it merge if you're kind of speaking a foreign language. Um, click on panorama. And when this opens up guys, honestly, you can come in here and you can choose spherical, cylindrical, perspective. You can choose one of these if you feel like it's going to help your image a little bit different. You can try, you can view it and see what it looks like. Um, but I, under auto select projection, it's worked every time just fine for me.